what's up, fellow 16 year olds? It's me, Steven, another 16 year old. Uh, sorry, mate, aren't you the guy I went to university with? I'm pretty sure you're like uh, 27. What's going on there? All right, guys, this is the sitch. In this magical, creepy world that is YouTube, there is a very creepy, creepy, really creepy content creator. Goes by the name of Snow. And basically what Snow and his channel do is they react to teen drama. Uh, he watches a lot of Musical.ly videos, he watches a lot of children twerking and dancing and teenagers kissing each other. And no, I'm not mistaken, that's actually what his channel does. Like, uh, what? Sorry, what? And many times in the past, he has actually been called out for faking his age by pretending to be younger so he can sort of, you know, infiltrate that uh, thotty kid community. And so this guy basically would pretend that he was underage for many years, um, and now he's saying that he is 18 or 19. I'm not even sure. Because he's not even sure. Because apparently he has been lying about his age for years and years and years. Everybody has speculated on it, but nobody was actually able to prove it. Well, that's until right now. There is a British YouTuber called Marky, Callum Marky, Marky. I don't know, that's his channel right there. He came out with a video a few weeks ago, basically exposing Snow, saying that this guy, this guy's being a bit of a creep. He's pretending that he is underage so that he can slide in there with the uh, with the teenage girls to what you know to, to, be, to be I don't know what he wants to do but it's I not good not good intentions I can tell you that right now and he basically just exposes snow and just how creepy he is towards kids like he uses like underage kids in his thumbnail he'll use like really clickbaity titles saying that like all oh, these teenage kids are gonna kiss you gotta you gotta watch you gotta watch and he will actually sit and react and watch videos of teenagers dancing and doing like weird teenager stuff and he looks really creepy when he does it so instantly like right off the bat you're just like oh oh I just don't feel right oh I don't even feel right doing this video he's like commenting love hearts on people's Instagram posts and you know he's saying stuff like oh I have a crush on this person I have a crush on this person he has a crush on a 13 year old and a 14 year old which even if you're 18 or 19, still creepy. But the fact of the matter is, he is actually 23, 24, 25 years old. So he should not be talking about that kind of stuff. And once this video dropped, everybody was like sending hate towards Snow's way, saying, you're a creep, you're a creep, why are you doing this? Shut down your channel. So Snow decided it was time for some uh, juicy, juicy revenge. So what he did is he purchased a whole bunch of dislikes. Uh, in the form of bots, of course, and he sent the dislike bots over to Marky's video to just downvote that to the ground. Now, previously, Snow has actually tried to take down people who have tried to expose him in the past. Uh, there was a previous YouTuber that he actually tried to sue. He tried to sue because they had revealed some personal information about him. So he wanted to sue on the grounds of being doxxed and having his privacy invaded, which straight off the bat does sound really creepy and really sketchy. Like, why do you have to go to that amount of effort just to like protect the fact that you're 19. Something's up here. Something's real fishy with that guy. So in the past, Snow has gone to great lengths to protect his identity, to not let his real age slip out. Well, that is until Marky made a reply video. He made a part two on his uh, little, little mini series exposing Snow. And he basically said, you know what? You're lying. Here's the proof. But this time Marky presented some cold hard evidence that just cannot be refuted in any way, shape or form. He first of all revealed that uh, Snow uses a fake name. He uses a fake name, not the name Snow, but he actually tells people his name is Alan, and he tells people his name is Alex, and he tells people he is 18 years old and 19 years old. But Marky was able to reveal through a couple of different sources, and he revealed that Snow's name actually isn't Alex or Alan, it's actually Senna. Senna Ferguson. Now, I'm not gonna get in trouble for this because this information is already out there because he left all his Facebook profiles and LinkedIn profiles completely open for the world to see. Again, if you're trying to hide the fact that you're not what you say you are, at least like cover all bases and you know, get rid of all the footprints that you've left behind because he really didn't do a very good job of actually attempting to hide the truth. He denied the truth a lot, but he really didn't do good enough to actually hide it. So Marky found all this stuff, he found out that... What did he find out? 
Yeah, he found out the fact that he like started college in 2012 or he graduated high school in 2012 and he became like a store manager of like some place, I don't know, in like 2014. So if you're doing the maths in your head, I can see that you are right now. How could a 16 year old at the time have a store manager job and graduate high school? That kind of sounds like something that someone in their early to mid 20s would do. Oh, who, who would have guessed that? So after exchanging a couple of barbs back and forth, these two decided to have a little debate, go head to head. So they appeared on one of the latest episodes of Drama Alert, hosted by DJ Killer Keem Star, and these two basically argued against each other. Snow was saying, you know, you're lying, you don't have proof, you're just a hater. Marky was just like, well, mate, like, I have the evidence. Like, you've said this, and you've said this, and you've sent dislike bots to my channel, and you've deleted videos after I've exposed you, and I have records here that say that you're this age, and this age, and this age. So, immediately, Snow was on the back foot, just trying to defend himself. This is where it all gets really, really cringy, because, you know when someone lies, and you know they're lying, but you just want to just keep them talking, and talking, and talking, to see just how far they'll actually go to not only convince you that that they're telling the truth, but also kind of convince themselves that they're telling the truth too. So after every point that Marky would drop and he would like provide this point with like heaps of evidence, Snow would just be like, no, no, not true. No, sorry, false, false, false. He like provided a form of ID. He sent that to Keemstar like during the actual uh, interview. And he said, look, like this is my driver's license. This is like a government issued ID. Like look at my age, I'm 19, that's it, end of story. And Keem was like, oh yeah, they're it says you're 19, yep, cool, 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 cool. Turns out it was a fake ID, it was actually his brother's ID. Ah, oh. and then Marky and Keemstar would just hammer on the point of, you know, you, you sexualize teenage girls, you, you're a creep. You're basically a creep. He is a creep. He is a creep. This is the best part, by far. When he was questioned about why he sexualizes teenage girls, like why does he have underage girls in his thumbnails? Why does he talk about kids kissing in his videos? Why does he watch videos of like, girls twerking? Why does he look at their silly little dance outfits? Like why, why would a grown man do that and think it's okay? His response to that, oh my God, oh my God. He basically said, well, I didn't make the dances. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't tell them to do it. Uh, and as far as the outfits go, uh, I have friends who do dancing and they said those are just the outfits that they wear. So, you know, it's not my fault. They're just there. I'm just there to look at them. That was his actual, actual, actual rationale for doing everything that he does on his channel. Let's just, let's just rewind a little bit, okay? So he lies about his age so that he can sort of get in there and like exploit teenage girls pretty much. Any evidence of that he's tried to hide but not really well. Anytime someone's tried to come for him and expose him he's tried to shut them down. Again not very well. And just his rationales are just completely stupid. And then after a whole bunch of back and forth of Marky just giving facts and drilling him and asking him questions and Snow going he's like oh blah 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 just giving like the dumbest dead shit answers ever. The interview came to a close because they really didn't get anywhere. This was really bad for Snow because it just made him out to be just 10 times worse than what he was. <laughs> oh, it's so gross. I feel, I feel filthy. I actually feel disgusting. Watching all this unfold, of course I made a video on it, so <laughs> I can't feel that bad. Um, there's really not much more I can say about that. Uh, if you really are that interested in it, I would suggest that you actually go and watch Marky's videos and go watch Snow's response and then go watch the drama alert little debate that they had because just this whole situation is just, it's just so odd because you have a guy who's doing weird stuff, he's been called out and then when he's called out, he's tried to come for the other guy really poorly and then the other guy was just like, well, mate, you're, you're this, you're this, you're this, you're this, you're this, and you're this. And the other guy was just like, oh, no, 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 no. But like, he's clearly lying. It was like the most blatant attempt at lying and failing I've ever seen in my entire life. And I've watched the show lie to me, all right? So I know when someone's lying, but this guy was totally, totally pulling the wool over everybody's eyes. Or at least trying to, because I don't think anybody believed him. He's such a bad liar. He is such a bad liar. You would think that if somebody was gonna spend that amount of time and that amount of effort in lying and trying to protect something that they know is not true, you'd think they would actually do it a little bit better than what he did. Ugh. Ugh. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's the end of this little video. If you enjoyed the vid, by all means, uh, feel free to leave a like or drop a comment down below. If you're new to the channel as well, make sure you 
do something to that subscribe button. Make sure you hit it somehow. Just hit it. Just hit it. I love you all. And I am 19 years old. <laughs>